Terima kasih, thank you Pak Zul. Eh, sorry. Uh, this talk will be recorded and will be uploaded to YouTube channel Ono Center. So please subscribe, click like, and everything. <laughs> okay. Uh, because the industry 4.0 is so huge, so big. I will focus on the foundation of it, with which is uh, human resource. Now, my this is a real paper I submitted to this conference. The uh, title is "Proposed Internet Offline, Not Online: Internet Offline Solution for Rural and Village School." So this is not online internet, this is offline internet. Why? Because uh, about one month ago, the Ministry of Education, Pak Muhajir, said that he will be, he's interested to re-include ICT class into the school. So in 2013, they removed ICT class from school. They want to re-include ICT class to school. Okay. But, but we have a lot of problem with that. Uh, some of problem, we need to prepare the curriculum. I will not talk about that because it's another lecture for that. Uh, we need to prepare for ICT teachers. We have 240,000 schools in Indonesia. Assuming we have two teachers in one school, we need 500,000 ICT teachers, which is none. So basically we have no ICT teachers. So we, what? Much better this one? Okay. Okay. So we need a lot of ICT teachers uh, uh, for, for this activity. We will not talk about that. So there's not a problem. The problem is infrastructure lab. We don't have lab, and for the infrastructure, I have prepared another slide for the infrastructure. I copy the slide from okay, uh, this one paper. Okay, this this is the condition of. Uh, signal in Indonesia. Special. You can download the ap application from this website, signal.com. Uh, and then this is what you look at. Uh, working? That one is much better. Where is the other one? Okay. Uh, this is the application. Oh, so bad, bad, bad. <laughs> okay, if you if you look at the application, uh, uh, we can see most of the islands, the Sumatra Island, Java Island, some of Malaysia are green. It means we have a lot of signal there. If we go to Kalimantan, the rest of Indonesia is bad. Okay, so not not much signal. If we zoom in, we can see a lot of problem. Okay, if you look at uh, Australia, this is Australia. We have see Sydney, Melbourne, and everything. But on the left, there is no signal. This is middle of Australia. There is no signal. But they have no problem because in the middle of Australia it's desert and a lot of kangaroo, no human, so it's fine. No signal is fine. <laughs> yeah, so they, they don't need signal. We human we need signal. <laughs> so we have problem. And this is the uh, far this is Perth and the uh, Western Australia. Uh, they have signal at the uh, so this one is our location. You can see Bandar Lampung at the bottom. 
this is our location. It seems to be okay because we have several operators. But if we look at one each operator one by one, this one three. The operator is three. The signal is less. This is oh sorry same three. This one in your start bad. This one telecom cell a little bit better, but still we can see a lot of blind spot. No signal. This one smart friend bad. Uh, Excel a little bit better, but still we have a lot of blind spots. So we need a solution where student can still learn without internet, but it looks like internet. The solution is. The solution is this one. Okay. I use this kind of equipment. This is the guy. Here. This one is not connected to the internet. It's standalone. And then this is called Raspberry Pi. This is called Raspberry Pi. It costs about 35 US dollar. In Indonesia, it costs about 500,000 rupiah, which is reasonable. And this one, oh, sorry, okay, oh sorry. The other one is this one. This one is Orange Pi. This is the guy. This one costs about 15 US dollar, one five. In Indonesia, it costs about three hundred fifty thousand US dollar, which is cheap. This one is very cheap. Right now, I'm running the server on this one. So the idea is very simple: to make the internet offline, we copy the internet into this guy. So basically, we copy the content here. Okay, and and then uh, oh sorry. You can see my, uh, the ID from this website actually. So I I, I will upload. I I right now uh, filming me myself. I will upload to this site. So we, you you can learn from this uh, channel. Okay. Uh, all the it's very right. Eh? So all the material I upload into my wiki. The URL of my wiki is lms.onocenter.or.id, and then you can read all the material how to build these things. So how to build these things? I put it on the web. It's free. You can build yourself if you like. So those from the uh, computer science department or computer engineering department, they can build their own internet offline. So it look like internet, but it's offline. Okay, now uh, this is the example. Okay, the website called dharmajaya.ac.id. The question is, where is the server? Is it in Dharmajaya or this one? Anyone can answer. Which one? In Dharmajaya or this one? This one? This, so this website, the one we look at, is not at Dharmajaya. The one we look at is in this small device. Okay. If we click some of the uh, program, this one, we can see the information locally. So the student can. Uh, okay, I, I'll show you how, uh, how. If we click this one. Uh, Select network, you can see sekolah Wi-Fi. So within this device, it has Wi-Fi. So this small device, it has its own Wi-Fi. It has Wi-Fi. It has server. It has everything. It costs five hundred thousand rupiah. So very cheap, and we can use power bank for schools. So this one is on the, the normal connection for phone, for charging, phone charger. So we can use power bank, the normal power bank. Uh, the whole thing very cheap, and we can have Wi-Fi in it. So at school, student can access locally. There is no need for 
internet. We need to copy these things. Okay? So, this is only the example. I can copy Dharma Jaya websites. And this one also, Dharma Jaya websites. This is the information about information system, undergraduate program. This one, information about uh, master in information technology, graduate program. And this one is about in undergraduate informatics. Okay, so all the thing can be copied here. Now, additional to this, okay, this is again Dharma Jaya. I copy, we can copy for free. Wikipedia, this is Wikipedia local here. Okay, now I will select random article, click random. It download from the web. This is article about uh, this one. Uh, I will click Rio. So it's article about Rio profits. I will click. Say I will click Lampung. This one I type. Type Lampung. So it will show us the article about Lampung. What is Lampung and everything. Okay. Uh, so I just realized Lampung used to be part of Sunda uh, Kingdom. So part of Sunda Kingdom and so on. And then here we have Raden Inten Tu because I don't know what is who is Raden Inten Raden Inten Tu. So I click Raden Inten Tu and then we can see the uh, history of Raden Inten. Who is Raden Inten and so on. This all of this is. Offline, local, in this 500,000 rupiah, and then we can extend this kind of experiment for other purposes. For example, for uh, uh, small, medium enterprise, for everything. Okay. In addition to this, I will add this is another wiki. This is dictionary. Wikipedia, they have wiki dictionary. This is we can copy everything offline, so and we can we can uh, input anything. I uh, say uh, we can enter certain Indonesian words or other words, and then we can uh, check the meaning of that words. Okay, for example, I will check the words. I don't know any suggestion. Dharma Jaya. Is there any? Meaning in Indonesian words, Dharma. Dharma means tugas, hidup, kewajiban, kebajikan. Which one is Dharma Jaya? All three. Yes. Kewajiban. All three. Yes. <laughs> so, so we can we can play around with it. So, student can learn uh, by accessing offline this one. So, we have seen the equipment like this. We have seen Wikipedia, we can make it offline. Uh, all how to do it, we have seen it. Now, we, I include several pictures, uh, sorry not pictures, movie. So, it can be accessed this way, okay. Uh, the movie is in this device. If you want to access, you can access it. The movie is in this device. Uh, this is the movie about Indonesia in 1910 to 1915. Uh, anyone have seen this kind of movie? Indonesia in 1910, 1915? No? Okay, I'll show it a bit. So we can play movie, not only web. Not only Wikipedia, we can play movie. Uh, sorry, the sound.
This is the condition of Indonesia in 1910, 1915. The movie is played from this device. It's delivered by Wi-Fi locally. So this device has its own Wi-Fi. It can deliver movie or everything. This small device like this. It's very cheap. And we can... Where is it? Water loop. I don't know where it is. This is in Jakarta, most likely, but I don't know where it is now. Maybe this one is in Lapangan Banteng now. Okay. So, that's my point in this talk. I like to show you that we can build something. Oh, sorry. I'll, I'll stop here. Uh, that's about to stop. How come doesn't want to stop? <laughs> okay. So my point is... <laughs> so my point is, you can always build something like this and it can be useful for schools in the region, our region. Because as we see, there is not much signal, not much internet. We are having difficulty to access the internet in the uh, village, in rural area in Lampung. So people actually need this, something like this. Otherwise, it's difficult for us to access the information. Otherwise, it's difficult for us, for those people to become smarter. Uh, so we need to empower them. And the cost for empowerment is not that much. The problem is how to select the uh, content. To be honest, I built this thing only in the last one week. Last week only for this presentation only. <laughs> so this ID is only one week ago for this presentation and I'm, I am I know it's very difficult, especially in select. For building this thing is not difficult. To select the content is difficult. I use 16 gigabyte SD card. So the hard disk, there is no hard disk here. No disk drive, no hard drive. The hard drive is micro SD, similar to our phone. Uh, so I use 16, one 6 gigabyte drive. So I put as many information in 16 gigabyte drive. If you have, you if you buy something bigger, of course we can put more. But still, we need to select which information we can put here and put it to the school. Having this, I'm sure the student will gain a lot of knowledge. We can, they can see a lot of the world. Because in the past, they are having problem to see the world because there is no connection, no internet. Having this kind of thing, I'm sure we can help. And I'm sure Dharma Jaya will be able to help people in Lampung. If people in Lampung gain, get the benefit from Dharma Jaya, I'm sure people from other province in Indonesia, they like to learn to Dharma Jaya. Okay, so that's my point. Hopefully it will give you some lights on how can we benefit to others and it doesn't cost much, uh, doesn't cost, cost that much, only 500,000 rupiah. It may be less, like this one is less and I'm sure people in that Majai can do this. Thank you very much. Okay, I think um, what you got from uh, the presentation is uh, we have a solution how to uh, to handle a problem related uh, related to the the missing link in um, what do you call it the access to the internet.